Hey what is going on guys, it's Thorish here and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're going to be talking about how to bypass the Ubisoft login screen on Ruse. So if you guys do enjoy this video then please do drop a like, comment and subscribe to the channel and let me know down below in the comment section if you do have any problems. Anyway, let's get straight into it. So what exactly are we talking about here? Well, due to the Ubisoft servers being taken down, the login process for Ruse after you launch the game where you would normally have to go and log in with your Ubisoft account, it can no longer be done. If you launch the game and you're a new player or you're installing it on a new PC or whatever the case is, if they take you to the Ubisoft login screen where you have to you know, type in your Ubisoft email and password and try to log in, it will just not work because the Ubisoft servers have been taken down. So how to get past that? This is what this video is gonna focus on. So all you have to do is you basically have to copy profile data from another Roos account. So it could be your friend's account, could be uh, just the default profile data that I'm gonna be providing you within this video tutorial. And yeah, you use that and you can bypass the Ubisoft login requirement, get to the main screen and play Roos like normal. So what do you have to do? Well, it's gonna be very simple. It's gonna be step-by-step -step guide. And by the end of this video, if you have any problems at all, as I said earlier, you know, just come join my Discord, send me a DM, send me a message in the Roost chat, and I will help you out personally if you are still having any problems. So all you have to do is, first step is you go and you join my Discord server, okay? This is my Discord server, Tharsha YouTube. If you're having any problems, there will be a link to it down below in the video description as well as in the pinned comment. So all you do is you first join the server, okay? So you'll join, you'll be in the welcome channel here. You may have to accept some uh, server rules or whatever. After you've done that, all you do is you scroll down over here to Roost Chat. Now, once you're in Roost Chat, it's very simple. You click Pin Messages and you see this at the top. Okay, this is a default file path, C program files times 86 team user data, this 2197 local. And then you will download this. Uh, this is the profile data that you're going to be using and you're going to be replacing your current profile data with. So all you'll do is you'll click download. It'll say potentially dangerous download. This download is fine guys, trust me. Click continue to download and now it will download. So boom, now that you've downloaded it, you can click show in folder. It will open up in your downloads folder. Now what you need to do is you right click on it and show more options. I'm on Windows 11 by the way. And all you do is you go and you extract here. You can extract here like this or you can extract smart new folder, it doesn't really matter. I'm just gonna go extract here and smart new folder. There we go. Now I have, uh, where is it? It should be here somewhere. There we go, it's over here. So all you do is you go into this and you get this profile.ruse. You'll see the date modified, you'll see the ruse file, all of that stuff. You go over here, you copy this. Now you go to your ruse file path, okay? Well, not exactly, but you're gonna to go to your wherever your ruse is installed on your device. So for me, my ruse is installed on my C drive. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to go to program files times 86. I'm gonna go down until I see Steam. Now that I've seen Steam, I'm gonna double click that. I'm gonna go till I find user data. Now that I have user data, there's gonna be a bunch of folders in here. Now you guys may have folders with different numbers and that doesn't matter, okay? You're just gonna go through here until you see uh, the folder that contains the 21970 folder. So I clicked on the zero, it doesn't have 21970. If I click on this, there's no 21970. But if I click on this, I will see 21970 right here. So just go and check every folder until you find one that has this as a subfolder. Once you see this as a subfolder, you're gonna double click on this and open it, and you'll see local and remote. Now what you're going to do is you're gonna to go to local, you're gonna go over here and you're gonna click paste. It's gonna ask uh, this destination already as a file name profile of Roos. Do you wanna replace the file in the destination? You are gonna say yes, okay? Because you need to replace it. I have a profile and I don't wanna replace it. So I'm gonna skip, skip this file. Okay, I'm gonna skip that. So it's not gonna replace my current file, but you are gonna click replace. Now you can go back to 21970 you're gonna to go to remote and you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna click paste and you're gonna click replace the file in the destination. And now you will have replaced it in both the local and the remote. 
I'm again going to skip this because I don't want to replace my own profile data. And now that that's done, you can close this, you can close your browser, you can close Discord, you can leave my server if you really want, but I suggest sticking around because if you do stick around, you can, you know, you can come up here, go over to the reaction roles, scroll up till you see this, and you can react with this bomb emoji here. This will give you the ruse role. You can see there's 188 other people that do have this role, which means when you are looking for a match, you can just come over to the RTS knowledge, come over to the ruse chat, and you can type at ruse, and you'll see the role come up, and you can say anyone want to play a match or throughs question mark see and this will ping everyone with the role so you'll ping like 180 people and you know you'll probably get someone joining to play some ruse with you that being said you can now go over to your steam and you can launch your game as normal and it should launch straight to the ruse main menu if you guys did enjoy this video if this video did help you out please do drop a like comment and subscribe to the channel and don't forget to turn on those post notifications Anyways, I will see you guys in the next video.